Hello, Columbia, and welcome to City Talk, where we are talking about great things happening here in the city of Columbia. We have with us today John Spade, who is the Director for Parking Services and Operations for the City of Columbia. John, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. All right. Well, I know we've got some great news to share. Um, one new development is that um, customers can now pay parking tickets and parking citations online, correct? That's true. We've, we've been live now for about uh, two weeks, and uh, this will be a permanent uh, feature that people can go online. They can go to ColumbiaSC.net slash parking, and there's a link directly to the site. Uh, it's fully secure. Uh, we're working with our partner in SouthCarolina.gov, mm -hmm. uh, so people don't have to worry about security of their credit cards and, and uh, making their payments of citations. People can pay their citations almost immediately after they get them. There's no waiting like there was with our old system where you had to wait till the next day to pay it before mm -hmm. it got into our system. So it's a fully live system. So the parking monitors that are writing citations out in the street uh, send that information directly to the cloud uh, and that uh, information is online so that they can uh, pay their citations. Uh, hopefully avoid late fees. You know, we, we, we really don't want to charge people late fees. Uh, they have 30 days to pay their citations mm -hmm. before a late fee um, comes due. So that gives them another opportunity, another way to pay their citations. If they don't want to pay by credit card, don't want to pay online, they can still go to 1136 Washington Street, Washington Square, and pay at the payment center, or they can come to 820 Washington Street and pay at the uh, parking office. Okay, and will they still be able to mail them in as well? can still mail them in in those wonderful orange envelopes okay. that we provide. <laughs> All right, so th they still have multiple payment options available to them. They do. Okay, and I hear that there's some other great news coming down the pipe real soon about parking and parking there, services. And, and one of them has to do with paying online. We're developing now the second module where customers can come in, set up an account, they can come in anytime using their username and password and look at their account history or if they thought they might have gotten a ticket and they weren't sure, they can, they can check it that way. Okay, all right. And in the interim, if somebody thinks they've had a parking ticket, they've misplaced it somewhere, they can call us at 545-4015, give us their tag number, we can pull up their citations, tell them what they owe. Okay, that's great. And I believe you've got something else you wanna share with us, correct? This is a really exciting one. Uh, this will be something uh, that, that it will help people from getting parking citations okay. because it will allow them to pay by cell. Um, they can use their cell phone, even a flip phone. You don't need an Android or an iPhone. Uh, you can do it uh, with a regular phone and call in. Um, we'll be uh, getting out information to the public sometime in the next month and you'll be able to pay by cell. And the, the neat part about this is say you go up to a two hour meter and you get a 30 minute meeting and or you're doing a little bit of shopping on Main Street or in Five Points or in the Vista, and oh, you're gonna be a little longer than you thought. Well, this new system will alert you and send you a text message 15 minutes before your meter runs out. That is awesome. Now, you won't be able to put more time on the meter than the but meters allow, but if you're at a green meter, and that's most of them in Columbia, mm -hmm. it's two hours, you only put, pay for an hour, you can um, pay for that extra hour if you want to through your phone and don't have to go back to the meter, uh, don't have to go back to your car. Okay, well we're really moving into, you know, the space age and, and with this new technology, so that's really wonderful and it's a great way to provide more customer service for our customers. It, it is, and that, that was the whole aim of this. It took us a while longer to get the payments online done and, and that was primarily because we wanted to make sure that we were PCI DSS compliant and that we don't have the problems that people have heard about, about people hacking into uh, their credit card accounts. Uh, that's not gonna happen with the system that we have now. Okay, all great news. And tell us again how they can access your information on the city's website and share your phone number. They can go to www.columbiasc.net slash parking and there's a link on that page that they get to on, in the main parking page that will take them to the payment site. Uh, there's also um, information on the back of the parking citation itself okay. that gives them that address, or they can call us at 545-4015. Okay, fantastic. Thank you for joining us, and thank you for bringing us such great news. Thank you. All right. We appreciate it. 
For any questions, please reach out to Parking Services and seek assistance. You can also visit our website, as John mentioned, at ColumbiaSC.net. And as these new developments come down the pipe, we'll make sure that we share that information with the general public and media outlets through our public relations department.